In this video, we'll review how the Power Integrity Analysis functionality embedded in CR8000 Design Force can be used to report on the voltage drop and current density of power nets. In order to utilize the embedded Power Integrity Analysis functionality, we simply go to the Design Force Analysis tab and select the PI EMI Analysis function. The first thing we need to do is designate the power source. In this case, it's component CN1 underscore source. Once we designate the source, we can move to the DC tab and we'll change the source option to yes for two of the power buses. The next thing we want to do is apply a load to the power source by specifying a power consumption value for two of the components. CN2 underscore main and IC1. In this case, we'll specify a power consumption value of 2 watts. We're now ready to run a DC analysis on these two power buses. To do so, we simply select the DC analysis icon. Once the analysis completes, the PI EMI analysis results display form appears. We can move that form aside and position it next to the circuit board to begin reviewing uh, the results. To review the voltage results, we'll change the color scale to min-max, and then we're able to select the power bus and the conductive layer that we're interested in reviewing. As we review the results, I'll switch from 3D to 2D. As mentioned, to review the results, Simply select the power bus and the layer that you're interested in reviewing. The display will update accordingly. If you want, you can hover your mouse over the power bus and display the voltage value. To review the current density results, We'll simply change from map type voltage to map type current density, and we'll change our color scale to any. Again, we can select the power bus that we're interested in reviewing and the layer that we're interested in reviewing. Since the power integrity analysis functionality is embedded within Design Force, once we're done reviewing information on the power buses, we can simply close the result display and continue routing within Design Force.